guys, it's Sarah here. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a Target try-on haul. So if you're interested in that, keep watching. And if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe before you leave so you don't miss any of my future videos. I post tons of content about fashion, beauty, lifestyle, tons of Amazon stuff if you're an Amazon lover. So definitely subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss out when I upload. All right, let's get into it. Per usual, every single thing that I am wearing, I will link in the bottom bar, whether it's from Target or not. I am wearing my heart medallion and the disc, ne disc necklace from With Love Sarah, which is my jewelry line, in case you're new here. That's linked down below with my coupon code just for you guys. And then I will also link my pants, shoes, accessories, hats, bags, anything else that I'm wearing with any of the outfits, everything will be down below if you're looking for it. All right, this is the first outfit. First, I'm going to show you this sweatshirt. I'm gonna put my bag down, but I just wanted to show you what it looks like style. This would just be like a running errands outfit, something super simple. This sweatshirt, in case you don't know, I lived in LA in my early 20s, so I have a very special place in my heart for LA. So when I saw this and it was in these cute pink and then like neon pink colors, I knew I had to have it. So this is my true medium. It is an oversized fit. So the sleeves are a nice length. And then I just rolled this sleeve just so you could see how it would look. This is probably how I would wear it once it's a little bit warmer out. I just think that's a cute little casual look. But this sweatshirt is pretty large. And it is just a typical crew neck with the ribbed bottom. And the same on the neckline. But I think that it's so cute. I just kind of tucked it under. You could also do a front tuck if you wanted to. But super casual, super simple. I love the colors. And there are a couple of other cities that they had. So you could do that. I actually purchased a large originally, not realizing that it was already oversized because I wanted it to be this nice oversized look. So <laughs> do not size up. It's already oversized. And then I wanted to show you these shoes. So these are, I think they're just the cutest little espadrille sneakers. And I will take them off to show you guys, but I just wanted to show you what they looked like on. I did get my true eight and a half in these. That is my true size. And I will link the socks. You can kind of see them there. Um, they are no-show socks. So if your feet are flat, you can't see them at all, even though the um, shoe kind of dips down around the ankle. I love these socks. They're the only no-show so socks that stay on and I don't have any issues with. So I will link those, but let me take these off so I can show you the details. These are the shoes. I think these are so cute. I'm not into animal print. You guys will never see me in like a leopard print cardigan or anything like that. But I have a pair of slides from last year, which actually, these are the slides. And these are actually from Target as well. So it's no surprise that I now am loving these ones. The back has this kind of like beige faux leather. And then there's white soles. But yeah, they are true to size. And I think that they're so cute. This is just like a little bit of a statement sneaker. You're going to be able to wear it with cute casual dresses like a t-shirt dress would be really cute or just jeans you could also wear it with cut off jean shorts and my sweatshirt anything like that these are going to be really versatile for transitioning to spring and then also spring and summer next up is this outfit i just threw on my sneaker wedges that you guys know i'm obsessed with and i have this sweater on i love the knit of this sweater i think that it is so cute it's really unique. I don't have another sweater in my collection that has this knit on it. And I will say, so I got my medium. The sleeves are nice and long. They're a really good length and it does have a split hem and it's slightly longer in the back, not much. Um, I have plenty of room in this, but it is a little bit short. So it hits right at the button. I'm wearing mid-rise jeans. So I could see sizing up if you wanted a more slouchy look. I personally like this one just because it looks a little bit more um, classic and fitted and I think like flirty. So that is why I stayed with my medium. Um, I really, really love this. I think that this is something that you could easily dress up or dress down. Like this is perfect for just running errands or something. You could swap out the shoes in a different handbag and wear it at night for date night. 
Um, the neckline is really pretty. I got makeup on it when I was trying it on in the store, but I love the neckline of it. It is a crew, but just like slightly wider, but it's not a boat neck by any means. And yeah, it's super cozy. I will say, if you live somewhere cold, this is not going to be the only piece you wear out because it does have holes in it. The knit is a little bit of a loose knit, so you're going to want to wear something else underneath it. But if you are inside, this is plenty warm. I kept the same sneaker wedges and jeans, but I swapped out my sweater and I grabbed this hat. This is not from Target, but I will link it for you in case you're interested in it. And I'm sure that Target has other options. I will link those as well. I'll do a little research. This sweater, I love the colored detail. So it's a bunch of different colors. Hopefully that's picking up. Okay, by the window it's picking up better. But you can see it's like cream, a light blue, a dark, I can't even tell if that's navy or black, white, just so many cute colors. And when it's all together, it looks just really marled. And it almost looks like it's just one or it looks like two colors, but then the closer you get, the more you can tell that it's more colors. Um, the sleeves are not a bell sleeve, but they aren't fitted. So they do have some room in there and they are nice and long. Again, I'm wearing my true medium and this is that same, the same length. So I'm wearing my mid-rise jeans and it hits right at the button. Again, I'm 5'7". I just did a little front tuck, but this is the same all the way around. So it's not high, low or anything like that. And then it does have just the same wide, just slightly wider than a crew neck neckline, but not a boat neck. I think this is also one of those pieces that will transition perfectly into spring. I could see myself wearing this with cut off shorts once the weather allows, which is not anytime soon because it is snowing outside right now. But in the next couple of months, this would be a really great piece to transition into spring with. You guys know I like to show the entire outfit how I would style it first. So this is like a completely nude neutral look. So I'm wearing those espadrille sneakers again, and then my same camel colored bag, and then this chunky sweater. This sweater, again, the sleeves are a really nice length. I did do a little front tuck, but you don't have to. It's definitely, a little bit oversized and it doesn't have a split hem but it does have a high low it almost looks like they just put scissors cut up and then all the way across by like one inch so it's yeah not split but slightly high low and I do like the details of this it kind of has like a rectangle or a diamond shape in the front on um, the knit is really soft and cozy and I really love the color of this so it's not quite just like a brown, it's almost like a mocha hot chocolate. That's what this looks like to me. But it is super cozy, I love knits like this. Again, this is nice and oversized, it's super comfortable. I love it with these sneakers. I can see myself wearing this right now with the sneakers if it wasn't a blizzard outside. And then obviously with boots, like snow boots or anything, it's obviously only January, but just kind of trying to think ahead so that you guys have options for transitioning your wardrobe into spring once the time comes. This pajama set is like the coziest thing of life. I love it so much. I've been sleeping, we turn our heat way down at night, like down to 61. And so I sleep in a long sleeve and I've been needing some more long sleeve tees. This is super duper thin. So it is perfect for sleeping in without overheating, but still staying warm. It has this little pocket that I will never use, um, but I love the stripes. And this is what it looks like untucked. It does have a split hem and it's slightly high low. And then I just did a little bit of a front tuck. The bottoms have this little drawstring. They do have an elastic waistband and they have the side pockets as well. This is just like my ideal set. I love that the cuffs and the neckline are solid and the elastic waist of the shorts. I like that those are all solid and then the rest is striped. I just can't say enough good things about these. They fit true to size and I'm going to be wearing these to bed tonight. I'm tempted to keep these on right now, but it's only like 4 p.m. so I need to put clothes back on. Alrighty guys, that is everything that I picked up from Target. 
I'm so excited about some of these pieces. I feel like they're such good additions and I think they're really good for transitioning my wardrobe. Let me know down below what your favorite piece was, where you want me to do my next try on haul from, and are you interested in me doing a transitioning your wardrobe from winter to spring video? I would love to share that with you guys. Give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed and don't forget to subscribe before you leave so you don't miss any of my future videos. Thanks so much for watching. Bye guys.